back to my channel. My name is Victorine Ditakwe. I am a Cameroonian based in Cameroon, Bamenda, and I make videos about the things that catch my interest in life. So I'm currently in my parents' place, and today I want to take you through how I cook garden egg stew and plantain. Daddy likes garden egg stew and plantain a lot, and I'm cooking it for him today. Right, Daddy? That's Daddy right there. Daddy loves fruits a lot. Yeah. <laughs> he lives on fruits. Fruit. Okay. I'm going to do a vlog that they are eating all the fruits in the house. The pears, the popo, the mango, and... Watermelon. Watermelon. Yes. <laughs> okay, guys. The kitchen is a little dark. We've not had electricity for a very long time. So, I am using the sitting room. At least the dining section. Because of the lights, like... Look at this light. Look at it. Look at it. Okay. So I'm going to use the ingredients that I'm going to use. And guys, guys, like I don't know how I'm only discovering this now. Roasted chicken is chicken. All this thing that we work and just fry and do stuff, that's not chicken. If you want to get the flavor of chicken, then you should roast it. You're going to enjoy it very, very in fact this is day three of our july challenge you know the upload a video a day for the first week of july i told you all a couple of friends and i decided to do this challenge and today i just want to give a shout out to divine obialo she's a nigerian based in cyprus divine i see your hustle girl so if you're interested in this g celebrity g's reaction to songs and lifestyle Please go show the girl some love. This is the garden eggs. I have to dice it in a bit. This is the tomato we're going to be using. And we have crayfish and seasoning cube. That's just all about it. So guys, I just diced the garden eggs. And if you want it smaller, you could do the smaller version, but I really love to eat my garden eggs when the bits are a little bit, you know, there. And I also blended the tomatoes. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to put the garden egg in hot water so that it gets a little soft, you know, a little cooked and give it a good stir. Yep. And when you're done, you want to strain it. And then right now I'm just putting my pot on the fire to start doing the tomato stew. So basically you just want to do it like tomato stew, you know, but you're going to add the garden egg to it later. Okay, so while this is happening, I get to grind my pepper and um, my crayfish. Okay, so give it a good stir and then you want to add your spices, the pepper, basically, yes, and uh, your seasoning cubes and your salt you know to taste yep you could add ginger garlic and all of that but i wasn't trying to have something very spicy i was trying to keep it as plain as it could be but if you want that extra flavor yes you can go ahead add your ginger and garlic and it's going to be amazing and guys what my mom usually does is that when she boils the garden egg she pounds it so that it's really really fine but like I said, I don't like the fine garden egg thing, you see. So the next thing you want to do is you want to put your beef, your whatever you have, the fish, the chicken, anything that you have into the pot and give it a good stir. Now when you hear this sound, you know that your stew is ready like that. Okay guys, so... What you want to do now is you get your garden egg and you put into the stew and you stir a little bit. Uh, the consistency depends on how you like it. Okay, you could eat it like this. But if I was alone, I would eat it like this. But it's a family house and I'm cooking a lot more. Like the quantity is more than what I would eat in my own house. So you just have to mix and mix and mix. And guys, that's just the easy work that you do for your garden eggs too. I'm going to be eating this with plantain and it was delicious, I promise you. Generally, garden egg sauce too is going to taste better when you cook it with the fish, you know, the dry fish, crayfish, all of that a lot in the pot, okay? But I wasn't going in for that. <laughs> okay, so this is what the food looked like. Hey, Mother! Hey, hey. 
if you found this recipe helpful please give this video a thumbs up i would appreciate that and if you haven't subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to check the description box for divine's link don't forget to subscribe to her channel and let her know you came from here i would really appreciate that see you in my next video i love you all so so much bye bye